Well, let me do this. Welcome to Punky's World. We're making chicken in the crock pot. I forgot to turn on the uh, microphone, so you probably didn't hear any of that. The chicken is still partly frozen. There is basil. Um, dried Italian mix. Beef broth, because I didn't have any chicken broth. Um, there's going to be potatoes. Why is that on? Yeah. There's going to be potatoes. Um, hmm. Oh, there's bl black pepper in here. Um, Herbs. I can't believe I did it. Oops. A little bit of oregano. Don't go nuts with oregano because your dish will taste like flowers. And don't worry about the stems because um, you're not going to pick out the herbs to eat anyway. One, two bay leaves. Bay leaves last forever. I love it. They dry just a little bit in the fridge and they last forever. The rest of this parsley, I have more parsley. There is nothing wrong with using the stems because I'm not actually going to eat them. Uh, sage, which is the uh, chicken herb of choice. Just going to pick some leaves. Um, Sage is kind of fuzzy. It's a weird herb in that sense. Probably the only herb that's fuzzy. <laughs> um, and rosemary. Again, just picking some leaves off. Um, okay. Finally, some time. It's marrying time. Time is little tiny leaves. Let me show you something. There are little tiny leaves on these ridiculous vines. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Okay. Time must take over when you grow up in your garden. It must absolutely take over given the fact that it grows on these vines. Potatoes. This is a fresh Italian mix. Which... There we go. Okay. Yum. Now to peel two potatoes and get them in there, and then I'll get some extra water in there. That's what I left that for. Okay. 
I'm peeling through the potatoes. Okay. I actually ran the dishwasher overnight. Um, uh, so I could get it done. And it, as the weather warms up, I would rather do that. I can be in my room with the door closed, and A, I don't have to listen to it. B, it doesn't heat up my whole dang house. <laughs> because I'm in my room with the door closed, it doesn't heat up my room. So I'd much rather do it after I go to bed at night. Usually I like to do it so that I can come back out and open the door a little bit to let things dry, you know? Um, but last night I turned it on a little late, so... Uh, but I did watch Terry Gordy this morning. It was, once again, really good. So. There we go. Okay. And what I'm going to do is, I'm going to put the cabbage in here as well. Um, but potatoes, I just have to basically cut in half. Ugh. Or in thirds. <laughs> Depending on ah, where the room is. Okay, I need more water in there for sure. It's splashing all over my hair. Where? Where's my towel? Ugh. I had a towel in here. Excuse my pants, but I had a towel in here. Um, okay, guys. This is perfect size. Mm. All you do. We can take the outside leaves off, just like that. Best way to clean a cabbage. Ugh. There we go. Now I need a bigger knife than that. Uh, okay. I'm gonna cut it. <clears throat> okay. Let me show you a little trick. You grab. <laughs> See this? It's a meat mallet. You simply hit the end of the knife with it. And guess what? You have two pieces. Now, that piece is small enough to go in just as it is. Okay, this piece has to be cut in half again. There you go. Put that in there. I'm going to cut this in half again.